Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an issue that says that this net framework is not supported on this operating system, and that this would also say that this setup has detected this computer does not meet the requirements to complete this operation. The following blocked issues must be resolved before you can proceed. So this should hopefully be appreciated for a process here, guys, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So pretty much I'm not even going to really show anything in this video because the answer is pretty straightforward. You may need to update your version of Windows 10 particularly. So you want to make sure you're running the most up-to-date version of Windows. Make sure you check a Windows update version. Make sure you go through Windows update, check for updates, see if there's anything to install. And then once your computer's all up-to-date, that's a potential issue why it's not being supported. But generally speaking, it, there's a lot of backwards compatibility with most net framework versions so as long as you're running the most up-to-date version of Windows 10 you shouldn't really be having a problem so I just want to put that out there guys and pretty straightforward tutorial honestly you can also go on to Microsoft's website and look up specific net framework versions and see what operating systems they support there could certainly be a compatibility issue you just want to make sure you're running an actual version that does support your operating system and if you're running a really old version of Windows uh, there's certainly a possibility that you're not going to get a newer version of that framework running. So just want to put that out there too. It's certainly possible. I guess some people don't realize that their 15-year-old computer that's running Windows Vista cannot install latest versions of that framework. But pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.